Okay, here we go. True confessions here. There are times in life where you have to take bold action, and that's just the way that it is, and take calculated risks. And I actually did that today. I mean, this is kind of an absurd example, but yet I think that it uh, illustrates the point quite well, is that there are different internet things that I need to send back to the U.S. to keep my communication lines in on a variety of different levels. And one of the challenges here um, is that sometimes you don't get very good internet connections. So uh, videos and things like that that should usually take 10 minutes to send then become an hour and a half. And I don't have an hour and a half because of the challenges that I already have with my time in terms of treating the riders and doing everything that I got to do. So we did find a reasonable sort of best option, if you can call it that, at the McDonald's here. And uh, there was a download that was actually quite long and I couldn't sit here with it and I could not not send it. So that's an amazing dilemma. So the creativity popped out of uh, this need and what I decided to do is I look up at the ceiling and I saw that there were actually like a, a first level of ceiling, a second level of ceiling and there was a space in there and I knew that the internet would uh, be broadcasting basically everywhere and all I really needed to do was to leave my uh, computer in McDonald's where I went back and went to work for another hour and a half. I mean in certain sense I guess that's fairly risky but in another sense it seems fairly secure in a sense that what my plan was was to put my computer between the first and second level and just let it run in the background to be able to transmit this long document and that I would come back which I'm here now to pick up my computer and uh, my hope is that it will still be where it was. I don't see why it wouldn't be. And then I need to get it down. So let's go in together here in a McDonald's and let me see if the computer first off is still there. And then I'll need to get that down and get back to work here. So here we go. Follow me. We're going to turn around here. And here we are heading towards the McDonald's door. So I'm going to open this up. There we go. And here we are inside. And now what I need to do is come over here. And let's see now. You can see that the, we got the partitions like right up here. And hopefully it should be up here. So we'll walk around. And sure enough, where is it? There's the, comp there's the computer. OK. So that's good news. I'm going to jump up here on this, so I don't know if you can see that, but here's my computer. So let me tap the space bar here. Oh God, there it is, and notice what we see there. It shows that the document has been transmitted. So I gotta tell you, this makes my day. And once again, ingenuity and trust and good planning rule the roost here. So here I have my computer, which is a good thing. Here I have me. And now it's time to go back and get to work. So this is Dr. Jeff Spencer broadcasting once again with the stealth operation here from France. And I look forward to sharing with you my next stealth operation. So until then, ride big and ride strong. We'll see you next time.